Do you know where we're going? We're going to the Amayano bus stop. So, uh, this was a game that was requested by Okami, and I am excited to play it. So, let me pull it up right now. Hello, you guys got to see chat for a second. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> Who's Okami? You're Okami. Honestly, you should just blare out bus stop every time you're about to play. I should. I should. <laughs> wow, I'm on TV. All right, let's jump into Amayato bus stop. I'm scared. Skimasakune. Oh. So it's got voice acting. <laughs> Who's born? Who's chat? Abduct. Born is born and I can prove it. <laughs> Who's a dirty adult? What a dirty adult you are. You got a free one, Barn. Who's Jackie? <laughs> Do you know of the story of the bus stop on the mountain road behind the school? Yes, I know. I know of it. It's that story of how a student from another school recently went missing, right? Yes, yes. As the story goes, after the student went on the bus, that student never came back. But it's strange, isn't it? After all, that stop hasn't had buses coming for to it for 20 years already. I'm at the bus stop! Ah, uh, yes, my mother told me that as well. If I recall correctly, the number of riding passengers dwindled so much that they stopped sending buses there, right? Oh. <laughs> Man, Okami, you got banned for some weird term that's like question marks and a block <laughs> that's pretty gay jackie who's the most beautiful person ever it is lynn and i'm not being incredibly biased and gay i'm just stating facts likely story jackie um i remember that the bus stop's name was amayado i would assume amayado bus stop Hi, hello. Hi there. I'm gonna deviate from where I am supposed to be going. Or maybe I have to go down. Is this an endless loop? Is this my own personal hell? I'll try going down. Hey, stand up you plain child. <laughs> Imagine knowing who you are. Couldn't be Kyoko Kirigiri. <laughs> Pocket Mirrors MC can't relate. God, you guys on a roll. Uh, is it? <laughs> Stop already. Uh, the kid is crying now. That went cool. Wait. Why do you do such things, even though I didn't do anything? kurosato san today while in school, I stepped on your shoes, right? Hey, Barn, you're a plain child. <laughs> what an insult, you plain child. Yes. Oh god, I forgot the guy. Yeah, it was Tosiaki, so get ready for some quality English translations. At that time, I felt it was my bad and apologized a lot, didn't I? But even so, you just ignored me and wiped away your shoes like a wimp that whole time, didn't you? Do you realize how much you've hurt me by ignoring me even though I was apologizing from the bottom of my heart? But, but it's, it's not like I was 
ignoring you or Jackie, you're a plain child. Chad is a plain child. <laughs> also, this shoe is something I had my mother buy for me recently and it's really important to me. And so So I didn't mean anything bad. Please forgive me already. All for quality translation. Her mom bought her a single shoe. <laughs> you sure are annoying. What a weirdo having her parents buy shoes for her even after entering middle school. What? How? How is that weird? Having parents buy shoes for you after entering middle school. Like, wait, do you just expect me to have the same same pair of shoes my entire life? Am I supposed to have a job as a middle schooler so that I can provide for myself with my own shoes? What is this? As for this shoe. Ah, uh, my shoe! <laughs> if it's really that important to you, why don't you go fetch it? Now we're going home already. See you later. Instead of tisk, I'm going tsh from now on. Yeah, these bullies are so sensitive to get offended by a girl ignoring them to clean her shoe. <laughs> a bucket. Maybe someone forgot it here. Hmm, there's something inside. Pudding? Put it there. A taint heart fragment. Where's Kana? Parents buying clothing and basic necessities for their even not even teenage daughter? What nerve! <laughs> What do I do? I can't reach. Reach farther. Okay, let's try reaching a little farther. Hmm, okay. Ah. I fall in. What? What's going on? <laughs> I, uh, I was able to retrieve my shoes, but now I'm all wet. Seems like I'll be able to wear it again after drying it, so I'm glad my shoes are not all ruined. It's disgusting that these parents take care of their children. <laughs> it's hard being bullied every day. But if I can continue to bear it, surely one day I will no longer be a plain child. No longer will anyone shoot at me. After all, every night I see a dream. The scene of spending time together with precious friends. I bet if you were able to go to the left, you'd find some child with a bucket on her head. <laughs> What is this? What? It felt like I saw something for a moment just now. <laughs> for just a tiny instant, a girl's voice. Follow the fountain, gain the power of teleportation, but on the condition that you can only do so in cutscenes. <laughs> it was from over there. I'm curious, so let's go check it out, perhaps. Can I see? Check party. Who is that girl? I got a heart fragment. Okay, so there's 12 of them. A clear fountain. Of course, I'm probably too old for this, aren't I? You're in middle school. Live your life. Don't let anyone tell you what to do. You're a child. Well, of course, people don't ride swings at my age, do they now? I still ride on the swings. I still ride on the swings, Chito say. My computer, it froze. I had to fix it. What has happened? So we started playing on the Yado bus stop. And we were called a plain child. And we were made fun of for having parents that provide for us. You can make a record of your play so far by investigating the automatic vending machines. You can also save by using water bottles, which you can find scattered about in various places. So they're like a one-time use save. However, you cannot save while you are being chased. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know that there are chase scenes, game. As an aside, it is recommended that you do not go back the path you came while you are being chased. I would assume. The vending machine. It stares at me across the way and it finds me wanting. 
I'm scared of stuff like the ring. Oh shit, that girl just disap- Well shit. A few days later, Chitose was found horribly disfigured. <laughs> God, I don't care how old I am. I'm going to play with the swings. Okay, so let's not follow the girl. A few days, we fucking excuse me. <laughs> she got isekai. She did. Chokakun, I'm a current. Currently, the buses do not come to the stop. The words have become worn out in places, making it unreadable. The guy was right there and he just drove away? <laughs> I guess so. She was just too plain. She was too much of a plain child to care to stop and check on her, I guess. Hi. Ah, uh, Kurosato-chan. You're still wandering around here? N yes Hey, you. Do you want me to forgive you for what was happening this morning? Yes. Go steal and bring back one of those sotoba from the cemetery you arrived at by going through the sewers ahead. If you do that, then I'll forgive you. Now what will you do? All you... What? <laughs> I'm not gonna do that for you. Fuck off. Uh, a sotoba is one of those wooden boards stuck behind a grave, right? There's no way I'd be able to do something so accursed as that. Ah, uh, I see. Well... I don't really care, you know? I'm gonna throw hands with Bully C. Plain girl does need to apologize for shit. Exactly. If that's that, we'll just go bully you tomorrow in even greater numbers. I like how it's got little voice acting in it. If you guys can't hear the sounds, let me know and I'll turn it up. My mom just called me. We ended the call, so my mom called back so she could hang up. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. Between, what did I get? A wooden board. This board looks very sturdy and doesn't seem like it'd break if I walk over it. It's okay. Do we gotta walk over it? Why are we going down to the sewers? What is the prompt for this? To steal from the cemetery? Okay, let's walk on the wooden board. <laughs> what did they just tattle on her for stealing the sotoba? It's a loss either way. Exactly. Obtained a heart fragment. Chokakun narrates the game until you die again. I, I don't know what Chokakun. Beep, beep. <laughs> I don't know what to do for that. Beep, 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 beep. Can someone please kill me? <laughs> There's something inside. Beep. Isn't Chukku an Optimus Prime? Maybe. Oh, wow. It feels a little scary seeing how it's completely dark inside. Oh, maybe I can be Tatsuya from Persona 2 because he's a motorcycle. A bucket. Yep. Guess I got a steal from the one that's adorned with a lot of flowers. I mean, beep, 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 beep. Hmm. Okay, maybe I gotta talk to the bully and be like, yeah, I'll get the sotoba. Room. I just meant it as a joke, but you're actually gonna get it? Then go quickly, you scum. 
before the sun sets. Well, fuck off. I'm gonna run over you. I'm gonna run over you because I'm truck -kun. I'm gonna send you to an isekai, but you're not the protagonist. So you get killed. Okay, let's... The sofa bar is hooked on and it doesn't look like I'll be able to remove it. Kill that bitch and throw them into the sea. Oof, boop, boop, boop. I took and removed one silk ball from the grave. Yeah, all lurkers are valid. I know I've got a couple of lurkers. Y'all are all valid. It's it's become night already. Well, it feels creepy, so let's quickly bring the silk ball to where the kid was. I mean, vroom, 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 vroom. What is that? Perhaps it's just my imagination. That just now, a man's voice. Who is it? Hello? Who is it? No way, that person has no head. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to run. What do I do? It's coming this way. Vroom! 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 Vroom, 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 vroom! What is this guy? Yo, kill him! Kill the bully! Kill the bully! Kill him! Oh no, it's mommy. <laughs> hey, Fujisato chan! Despite telling you to bring back a Sotoba, what is this that you brought back instead? Your death! Kill him! Kill him! Yes! Yes! Kya! <laughs> Don't come! Uh, he was happy. Yo, yo, that, that dude, that dude was a bro. He, he gave us a solid. He killed that dude. I'm happy. Just what was that? That headless person just now. In any case, we'll need to report this to the police quick. First, let's go back home. How about we don't? How about we just be happy with our life? Thank you, headless ghost. Thanks, mommy. Mommy looking out for us. Will I get run over again? I guess not. Mommy Tiro for knowledge, that bully. Takun is satisfied with the sacrifice you can stop. <laughs> I personally would just return the salt above, but okay. It's raining. I'll need to get back home quickly. I just plain wouldn't steal the salt above in the first place because why should I? Amayado, currently buses do not come to the stop. There's a cute girl over here, I think. Yep, that looks definitely like a cute girl. Were you here this whole time? Take it and become friends with the Headless Ghost and keep appeasing him. Yeah, he's my bro. Me and Headless Ghost, we bros now. We best friends. Yes. Then, did you see what happened at the bus stop on the other side? You did pretty well getting away from it, hmm. But it'll surely come again to kill you. You know what? If he wants to kill me, that's okay. He gave me a solid. By it, do you mean that headless man? You mean mommy? Could you possibly know what that person was? It was a magical girl. Hey, tell me! Just, what was that? I'm sorry. It's about time. I'll need to get going now. About time? About time for what? To die. To get isekai with Chakun. Amayado, Amayado. Please be careful not to forget your belongings as you exit the bus. Eh, what? Did something just come here? This is 
the new Madoka movie. <laughs> Please make way, since I'll be writing on this. Get on the bus, Chitose. Hey, wait, what is this? It's an invisible bus. Now, I'll be going on ahead. Have you ever read Harry Potter, Chitose-san? Hey, let me go. It's dangerous to go into the road so suddenly. You might just get isekai by Truck-kun. Uh, the bus went away. I wanted to be in an isekai, Chitose. Don't you understand? I could have had a harem of maids and cat girls and assassins. Bus? There shouldn't have been any buses coming here for a long time already. I kind of want to hear El Dub Homura. Ooh, that would be fun. I've I've uh, done the voice for Madoka as well as Iroha and Mommy a few times for some stuff. I also got the part of Rena in a um, Magia record panda, but that never went anywhere. <laughs> There shouldn't have been any buses, yep. Hey, your name is? Eh, me? I'm Chitose. Furusato Chitose. Chitose, how old are you? Huh? You mean my age? Shaking my fucking head, plain girl just wouldn't understand the appeal of being isekai shaking my fucking head. <laughs> well, I'm 14. Fourteen, the same age as me. Hmm. Hey, Chitose. Let me stay at your house this night. Uh, I don't know who you are. Why would I let a random person go into my house? Eh? Well, why? Because it's due to you that I wasn't able to ride the bus. Don't you? Don't you guilt trip me over that? Perfect age to sign this contract. But she's a cute girl, right not? Okay, I do have a ton of things I'd like to ask you in any case. What? What would you ask her? Yes. She might just be, like, pretending that there was a bus to you because you didn't see anything. And then she's like, haha, since you made me miss the bus, now you have to have me come to your home so that I can murder you. She's going to kill your family for not allowing her to get isekai. <laughs> Then lead the way. Are you following me? To marry her, of course. Ah, uh, yes. We're gonna get married. Something over there? A cat. Let's pet it. A cat? I wanna pet it. Ah, uh, the cat went away. A black cat. Most people think that that's superstitious for bad luck, but I think it's good luck for me to see a cat so that I can pet it. Meow, meow. A sign of bad luck. Nah, it's a sign of good luck. Please don't say such scary things. Okay, let's save over here. I guess this is our house. Come on in. I curse you. I mean, meow. <laughs> Excuse me for my entry. Hey, you're the one that wanted to come to the house. Oh, and it seems like I haven't asked for your name yet, so could you tell me what it is? Written as a bell, Suzu. It rings, Naru. With a small call. Pigeon, Ato. It's Suzunari Kobato. <laughs> so you're called Kobato-chan. A cute name, isn't it? Have you read the manga of Kobato-chan, Kobato-chan? Seems like there was a nearby lightning strike. It's a blackout now. Well, there's no use 
just standing here, so let's go to the living room, I guess. Kabato is such a cute manga. It is. Let's carefully put away those shoes I had Mother buy for me. Yeah, and not make fun of her for having bought it because I am a child and should... Let's see, it seems to be locked. Oh, I still have the Sotoba. Yeah, let's, let's use that. Checks out. We got this from the old lady next door. This flower sure has been raised beautifully. Hmm? There's something inside. Fun fact, it's actually white cats crossing your path that's bad luck, as it started in East Asia where white is the color of death. It only changed to the color black because Salem was overrun with black cats, and thus they changed it to black cats. It made up the fact cats are similar to basically have an excuse to kill the s cats. Ah. I really hate that, like, black cats are seen still so negatively because of that. Like, I've... I've seen so many things of, like, people, like, doing fucked up shit to, like, black cats. Or, like, black cats not being adopted because, ooh, it's a superstition. Like, it's not. It's just a cat. It's just an adorable little baby boy. I have three black cats. Aw, oh, you should post pictures of them sometime, Baked, because I love looking at pictures of cats. Two are opera singers. Aw. That's adorable. Pleasant smell of perfume. When is an angry mother? I love them. Is there like a massive shit in here? No? Okay. Hmm? Mother? Mother, I'm back. Where are you? This is strange. Just where did she go? Okay, we got a water bottle, so we can save at some point. This phone broke and became un unusable a few days ago. I swear to God, if we get cursed for stealing the Sotoba, I'm gonna be so angry because that was all that bully's fault. There's not much interesting one at this time of the day, is there now? She left because she didn't want a plain child. <laughs> yes, the mass murder of cats is what nearly got us killed during the Black Plague, and our annihilation is eminent for being sacks of crap, which is why we deserve the plague's full effects. <laughs> right? If you guys are going to be mean to cats, then fuck y'all. Cats are the best, and they deserve all the love. It's pretty, isn't it? This painting of a flower. Flowers within paintings are pretty, aren't they? Huh? Why? Because no matter how many days pass, it'll never wither. Well, of course, but that's quite a sorrowful thing to say. Mirrors at night somehow feel scary, don't they? Bloody Mary, bloody, bloody Mary, bloody Mary, bloody Mary, bloody Mary, bloody Mary. That started me. I'll need to clean it up later. Bad luck. I feel the presence of several people inside. What? <laughs> if I made an imperfect copy of Mega Man X to save us all, but instead he starts wiping out humanity and saving cats. Very good. That's the kind of Mega Man we need. At night time, be sure not to forget to shut the curtains. Grandpa, just why was this your will? I went. That was his will? Thanks to that, Mom and Grandmother are still disputing over the inheritance. Mysterious grandfather, wasn't he? Yeah, but he was a kind grandpa who always worried after me. So even now, after having gone to heaven, I feel as if he's still looking over me from somewhere. I guess he's gonna chase after us at some point. I see. That'd be great if so, wouldn't it? 
nighttime, be sure not to shut the curtains. Not to forget to shut the curtains. Yeah, that's so weird. <laughs> that's the will. Fiend Tose is suffering. Ever since I was little, I've always disliked the sound of this clock for some reason. I mean, it is a default RPG Maker asset, so it's understandable why you would be annoyed by it after playing 5 million games that use the same sound effect. There's various small things inside. Look, if I made a will, it'd be much weirder. If I made a will, I'd give all of my shit to cats. Grandpa gave great care to this hanging scroll. But just who the heck drew this, I wonder? Some cat food and a laser pointer should be enough for the VIP seats. Just now, it feels like I heard something from inside the Fusuma. Okay, you're not gonna do anything? Okay. Can I go outside? I want to save. I feel with no more Fatal Frame. Uh, I want some more Fatal Frame, bro. It hurts. Okay, so that was the... Yeah, so here's the kitchen. Okay, let's use the Sota Bot to unlock everything. It wasn't shut off very well, so there's a water dripping from it. Hmm? There's something falling inside. Nintendo, we need a new fancy exclusive horror game for the Switch. <laughs> what if we worship the cats like gods, bring fish, gold, and myrrh as our ticket price? Very good. What it did. Please, bring worship onto the cat gods. You know, the Egyptians were right to worship the cats. Nintendo. Deadly Premonition 2. Goddamn. Maybe one day I'll also be able to get good at cooking like mother. I want another Fatal Frame, please. Please. I, I suck at Fatal Frame, but I would love to play it. The rain is getting stronger and stronger. Don't forget to shut the curtains, Chitose. Kobato-chan, are you hungry? No, I'm fine. And in any case, there's nothing other than fish sausage inside, is there? Why do you only have fish sausage, Chitose? Are you a cat? Fish sausage? What's that? Eh? You don't know? It's processed minced fish. I hate fish. You shouldn't say that. Fish is good for you. My grandpa's tableware is about time for it to be moved somewhere. Deadly premonition was an exercise in seeing just how much you could handle before going insane. <laughs> she told say is a cat. She told say is a plain cat. This microwave has already become quite old. Okay, let's see. There is no need for me to go to the second floor, is there now? Yeah, let's use the Sota Bud to unlock it. Okay, did I miss a room? Also, why do they still have their food out there? Okay, maybe. <laughs> I don't like that noise. Oh, oh, what was that? That creepy voice. Ah, uh, yes, I too walk into my bathroom just to open and slam the toilet seat because of demons. <laughs> <laughs> Any 
brought them along with you. And what's more, you brought along a whole lot of them. Brought them along? You mean those headless men from a while ago? You too, Bart? I thought it was the only one. <laughs> That's not all. The ghosts from the grave. All of them. I did that a lot. Those things need to stop taking up the restroom. The grave! It's my fault. It's because I stole a sotaba. I'm trying to take you along, Chitose. To that other world. Take me with you! Everyone here just calls me a plain girl and makes fun of me for my mom buying me shit. But that's... What can I do? If you don't want to die, then you should quickly get out of this house. And we got a chase scene coming up. Y yes Understood. Oh my god. I wasn't fast enough. Uh, huh? This place? Tose, you're sure not being a plain girl if you're bringing home headless men at this time of night. <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> well, I died. Okay, chase scene time. Oh wait, I'm supposed to shut the thing first. Uh huh. Let me do that. Well, I died. Stream stops working for me. <laughs> oh. Shut that. Don't sign the contract, MC. Never sign a contract. You know this not only from Model Cup, but apparently your turn to die as well. Hey guys, come after me. Come on. Bye! No! Oh no, the door won't open! there. Get out of this house immediately. It listened to what you said, Kobato-chan? For now. Should be alright for a little while. Probably, at least. Kobato-chan, who the heck are... The, the power? What a relief. Now with this, I'll be able to call Mother and the police. Before that, would you let me take a bath? If we just stay wet like this, we'll catch a cold. Oh, let's take a bath together, Kabato-chan! Okay. The key to the bath was certainly in a place where small things are stored. So can I go outside? Kabato has now solidly become Chitose's best friend slash girlfriend, and that is a fact. Indeed. When you invite a girl to your house, you just are instantly girlfriends. Can you guys clear the, the fucking table of the food? Like, that is probably really freaking, like, attracting flies or some shit right now. Like, come on. This phone broke and became unstable a few days ago. Uh, 
Sabato and Chikose are the typical magical girl protags. They are. They, the cutesy one and then the really gay silent one. Okay, I know I'm supposed to go to the bathroom, but... Gosh, they should at least cover their food, right? Where's the bath? Yeah, let's use the sotoba. Oh, okay. How do I get into the bath? Is it here? Let's use the salta buff. Hmm? There's something fallen inside. Korete. Obtained heart fragment. Very good. How many of those do I have? I got five. There's like 12 of them, right? How do I get into the bathroom? My grandpa's tableware. It's about time for it to move elsewhere. Okay. Am I missing a room? Because I tried that. And then that's grandpa's room. She won't let me go upstairs. The frick? Here, let's use the water bottle. God. Where is the key? Give me the key. Oh, maybe, maybe she's got one of those fancy ones outside. No. Yeah, speaking of magical girls, who's excited for the second season of Magia Records anime? Me too. Okay. Where the frick? Okay, I know I have to go and take a bath, but like, how? How do I take a bath? Take a shower. <laughs> The rain is strong enough. <laughs> but they're taking a bath because of the rain, Barn. Okay. Let's see. Oh! Okay. 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 How do I take a bath, Ellie of 2020? Okay, I examined it, but not just, just the wrong side of the thing. Okay. The water actually went out a few years ago and I had to wash my hair in the rain. Oh man. <laughs> no wonder Misane called you a dirty adult. <laughs> the faucet wasn't shut off very well, so there's water dripping from it. Hmm? There's something falling inside. Yes, give me all the heart fragments. A ton of bath towels. Do we get a CG? No, we just get naked sprites. Um, why are we going in 
into the bath together? Well, we don't know when there might be another lightning strike that results in a blackout, right? Who's ready for the fan service scene? Uh, I see. That's also true, I guess. And besides, I don't have any clothes to change into. So, Chitose, lend some to me, okay? You're asking for awfully a lot. Yes, understood. By the way, Kabato-chan, you were wearing a uniform, but which school do you go to? It looks similar to my school's uniform, but the colors are somewhat different, aren't they? Calling it right now. I bet you that she, like, died a couple of years ago, and so that's why, like, the, uh... The uniform is a bit different because their their uniform evolved and she went to the same school as her. Calling it now. School? My school is... The next town's third middle school. Huh? Third middle school? I've never heard of it. But if it's the next town, we might have actually met before, haven't we? Crap, she's doing what we were warned about in Quirk's Party Book Shadows. <laughs> now, perhaps it's about time for us to leave the bath. Also, Chitose, you're probably worried about how your mother hasn't come home yet, are you? Yes, I guess so. After all this, I'll try calling them to ask where they were. Kabato-chan, those clothes fit perfectly. Oh yes, we get the full sprite. Oh, so she's some heavenly host elementary. Well, fuck, this is gonna get bad fast. <laughs> Aw, she looks cute. Thank you. Now, more importantly, we'll need to make a call quickly. Ah, yes. The phone in the living room is broken, so... Perhaps we can use the phone in my room upstairs. Kabato is the only one who doesn't think Chitose is plain. Wait, hold on. Can I examine the rest of it? Maybe it's about time for the shampoo and conditioner to be replaced. The shower. I already got out of the bath. You can never be too clean, Chitose. Get clean, get cleaner, so that no one calls you a plain girl ever again. Okay, so yeah, I, I noticed the sprites do change. I noticed she was in her school uniform, and now she's not. That's nice. Okay, so this has to be our room, right? I guess that I don't really get in the mood to open school textbooks at home, can I? Need a water bottle, hell yeah! There's various small things inside. Oh? Honey, let me call that. This is not the time to sleep, is it? What if she's so clean she becomes more plain? <laughs> Imagine having a backstory to your channel name, right? I just put in things that I like. And then boy. God, that reminds me. That was my original username too. My original un username was just animal I like, thing I like, and then lover. And now I'm thing I like, animal I like, boy, God. For now, let's get in contact with Mother. She gets so clean that she scrubs away any distinguishing features that she may have once had. <laughs> Be like that episode of like a uh, fairly odd parents with all the blobs. It's no good. It won't go through. Then this time, I'll tell the police about what happened at the bus stop. 
It's not going through, is it? Is this the police? Uh, well, what do I do? Continue calling. Um, this is the police, right? Wolves and the Akatsuki Gundam are cool, I guess. Wait, what if I made that my new username? <laughs> God, mood. What's going on? Someone's playing Guitar Hero. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. I guess I just got rocked way too hard. My old username was literally favorite tales of Protag and Nep, literally. <laughs> Did I just hear the Aya death and scared shriek noise? Yeah, it's like a, it's used pretty regularly in horror games. Yeah, okay, the, the blinds got closed. A ton of clothing inside that mother bought for me. She couldn't handle Reckles Rock. I have no reason for my username. It was merely the name I used to anonymously play an online game that my programming class was playing. Couldn't tell you why I picked it. <laughs> so it was like a random name? A ton of clothing inside that mother bought for me. All right. Let's get in contact with mother. But let's hang up when we call the police. All right, there we go. We done? Not good. Where am I going? You know, I don't know. I guess I'll just go where the Amayata bus driver goes. I'm at Amayata bus stop. Let's see. Hang up. This phone is creepy. Okay, we can't open that. Not so anonymous now that we know you, huh? I think I just saw something in that room, but let me go save. I don't wanna use up those water bottles just yet. I wanna have like a good hoard of them before I start using them. Seems to be locked. But then they became wise to the fact that someone from the class was playing with them and they sure locked the hell out to sniff me out. And that was my IRL nickname for like eight months in that class. Oh. <laughs> I didn't expect to advance Barnes character quest this much today. <laughs> Social link up. Let's see, do I have any... Yeah, I just have the sotoba and the water bottle. We should probably return the sotoba. Okay. All right, let me go back into the grandpa's room. Yeah, we're certainly not closing the shutters now, grandpa. Oh shit, there's the headless dude again. Just wait until you get my backstory of how my sister is actually my ancestor from the distant past. That would be wild. 
Have you just revealed another secret about your life, Barn? Dang, Okami is already on Barn's route. <laughs> Incarnation is whack, my dude. <laughs> okay, let me see. I don't see anything. Fucking that is a fucking Is there anything in the toilet? No? Okay. Let me see. up right now, she told say. I saw he went through there, but I don't have anything to open it. So I assume I have to find a key. Let me see. that I keep examining that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Yes. Oh! Well, there we go. A key. That'd be interesting, but did you unlock the items for the free time events? We gotta play some Tetris then, man, Okami, if you don't have the free time events. You either gotta play some Puyo Puyo or Tetris to get the money. Okay. Step back up. Go in here. No. Wait, yes. Okay. Just realized life would be easier if we were forced to live by dating friendship making game roles, right? The flowers we received from the neighboring old lady raised quite beautifully. Oh, do you want to know what I just realized that makes Asteria really boring? What? This is not the time to sleep, is it? Well, there's documents for work are scattered on the floor. Like, just hand someone an item, and then they just hang out with you and you learn more. Right? Mirrors at night somehow feel scary, don't they? See, if we did that in real life, then people would just be saying, Elio, you're buying a prostitute for services. And I'm like, no, I'm just giving her some money to develop our relationship. What don't you understand? Mirrors at night somehow feel scary, don't they? There are no real mini games or long side quests that get you to like any characters. It's all just combat. It's a straight story with no diversions. Ah, Aw, man, that sucks. I have Zestirian. I've been meaning to play more of it. That sucks that it doesn't have any of that. Because that, that really does give you, like, the progression of, like, getting to know characters more. Man. I don't really understand computers much, do I now? Computers? I... Are you not good with computers too, Kabato-chan? We've recently been using them in class too, making it quite the trouble. What is a computer? Eh? Hmm? Yes, I knew it. She's been dead for years now. I, I like how the papers just slipped off into oblivion. Pokita. 
Alright, we got the back door key. It's various small things inside. Alright, that should be everything. Let's head on outside, get another save. No, I also suck with computers. Does that mean I'm dead too? Well, I mean, you know what computers are, Okami. She doesn't know what a computer is. Was it? Yeah, it was here. She told stay on Instagram. Me and the undead GF learning what computers are. Let's go. Oh man, that would be so cute. <laughs> Let's use the back door key. Why do we have to go through the back door though? Why can't we just walk around? Oh, coffee and sweets. I want some coffee and sweets. Buy something, something, something. This is strange. That headless man back there definitely did come outside, right? Fun fact, if a ghost asks you for anything, whether it be an item or a favor, you shouldn't do it or they can get control over your body and slowly drain your life energy until you die. <laughs> the more you know. Well, maybe you just saw it incorrectly. Right, Chitose? Hmm, you actually do know, don't you? Well, do I know? But even if I did, I can't tell you. Hmm, Kabacho-chan, you meanie. Instagram is cute when it's fictional characters, but in reality, I dislike Instagram. <laughs> I've never used an Instagram. I made like an Instagram account and then I never used it. <laughs> There's like a voice acting thing and then they're like, contact me on Instagram. So I made an Instagram and I'm like, okay, here you go. And then I never logged back in. Oh shit. I'm leaving first now. Now that is not a fun fact. It's a fun fact if it saves you from being killed and you're like, yay, it's so fun to be alive. It's pretty fun if it's not gonna happen to me. Exactly. What, mother? I just finished with my part-time job though. Eh? That person still hasn't come back home? Jeez, okay. I'll go look for that person. Hope it happens to me. I crave death. It is a very fun fact. <laughs> it's fun if you're adventurous. Yes, yes. So, I'll be hanging up now. If I find that person, I'll call you back. What's with her earrings? Like, they kind of look like they're, like, tilting up, up, and away. Like, they're not heeding the laws of gravity. <laughs> Same Jackie, I wish for its release. What are you looking at, brats? This ain't a good time for kids to be walking about. We're going on a date, excuse you. Get back home quickly and go to sleep. Jeez. Hey, out of my way. You're blocking my way. Hmm? Where have I seen your face before? This is some organic <laughs> character interactions right here. Eh? Uh, no. It's just your imagination, I think. Of course. There's no way I'd be acquainted with such a plain person as you. You Are you related to the, the bully? Cause fuck y'all. So then, hurry up and get out of my way. You're in my way, I told- You know what? There's an entire street. You can walk- all the way around me, but you're choosing to do this confrontation. This is your fucking choice. So screw off. Bitch. Wait, that person just now. Machine acquaintance of yours. In truth, I've been bullied at school, you see. That person just now. It's the older sister of one of those bullies. Hmm. Hey, Chitose. Do you want revenge against those bullies? Eh? Uh, revenge? But that's how 
to meet the other parents of your harem. Talk to someone as they're leaving work and block them on the one tile sidewalk to make them interact with you. Only for them to hit you with the plain girl comment you've gotten all day. <laughs> if I did that, I'd be bullied even more. It'll be fine, because I have an idea. Let's kill some bitches. If you decide to do so, let's head to the school right now. Right now? You say? When it's this late at night? I can't do that, because going to school at night is not allowed. I mean, you stole that thing from the graveyard, so... What are you saying? We're going precisely because it's nighttime and there's no one around. Are we gonna... Yo. Are we gonna go on a date in a school? Close at night? So anyway, quick. Take me to your school, Chitose. Okay, Kabata-chan. You sure have a more forceful personality than you look, do, don't you? But we're going back home right after going there a little, okay? I'm not really in the mood for revenge anyways. Kabato is truly the dark magical girl archetype. Someone just mentioned best Yu-Gi-Oh card girl. <laughs> I just mentioned an archetype. <laughs> Let's spread curses heavenly host style. Um, the quickest way there is to go through the part... What? I, I totally butchered that line. The quickest way there is to go through the park, perhaps. Wait, let me see. Oh, she has the mood for revenge, I see. <laughs> is that a person? Hey, is there anything you want to know? Number of steps... Oh. Is it? Is this game gonna give me a bad end for saving a lot? You have so far walked 3,059 steps. Is there anything else you want to know? Is this game gonna give me a bad end for ta doing a lot of saves? So far I saved 15 times. Oh no. Chitose, say, Kabato is mentioning revenge and you're saying you don't want to join in? No wonder people call you plain. Oh boy, I'm gonna cry if it's one of those where it's like, don't save, risk it all. Oh, I don't think so? Okay, thank god. So it's just like a little fun thing. I see. Why can't you just walk around that? Chitose, why do you have to go through your house? Just walk around it. Just who is it in the middle of night like this? It's okay, Elle. You can say Resident Evil. <laughs> I'm coming! God! I like this. feels somewhat scary. <laughs> Hi. Th there's no one here. It'd be great. It was just a prank. But it wasn't. Also, yes, I love playing Resident Evil games and being able to see that there's a path that I can go through, but it's like, oh, no, you, you can't open that door. Oh, no, you can't go through there. Unfortunately, it's raining today, but unusually we'd be able to see the starry sky from here. Now, that ghost needs to chill, right? The starry sky. Recently, I haven't seen it much at all, have I now? If you like seeing the stars, let's come again next time on a clear day to see them together. Are you asking me out, out on a date, Chitose? Kabato-chan? Is something the matter? No, it's nothing. That's right. Okay. If we get the chance. Yes, it's a promise! Yakuzaku da yo! Yuseki da yo! Chitose taking the initiative. We love to see it. Oh, that's not the save point. Okay. There's something over there? No. Okay. 
surprised they're not giving me a chase scene here. Like this would be the perfect area for a chase scene. Before we go to the school, let's return the Sotopa back to the grave. Okay. Well, I think the game's gonna make me eat those words. Sotoba. Sorry for taking it without permission. Now with this, please forgive me. Imagine eating words. It's gonna come out of the well, isn't it? God. <sighs> Bye. I can't save. I can't save. Oh no. They're, they're not chasing me. Imagine eating lies and crossing a laptop. <laughs> it's fine. Those children are no longer angry at you. M what a relief. So they forgave me. It's because they're good kids who forgive when a proper apology is given. Hey, Kabata-chan, just, who were those people, really? Those children were kids who died in these lands, believing in a certain teaching, and then luckily were unable to go to peace. So they were part of the Heaven's Gate cult? Of the Shinryo? But that's... Isn't there any way those people could be allowed to go to peace? It's not so simple. It's best not to think that you can save them with only casual feelings in mind. Uh. Can I save now? Thank you. Ah! My laptop just... Hello? Hello? Hi? Hello? <laughs> the game crashed. The game crashed. Stream, the stream is dead? Let me see. No? Oh, I can hear you. Stream is still alive if I'm right. Okay. Well, uh, so <laughs> the game crashed for me uh, right as I was saving. Uh, so <laughs> let me see. Will it? Oh, where's my save file? Okay. I, it managed to save. All right. I hope you had bus insurance. <laughs> I hear the taxes for bus insurance are quite high. It pays to be insured. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's continue after that scare. The game haunted me by giving me that freaking crash. You guys can see the game and everything. All right, right? Let me see. Yeah, I think you're good. All right, let's go. I wonder if we're getting a new dialogue here. You can ride the swings. It's okay. It pays more if you're isekai <laughs> A clear fountain. Is there something there? Oh, the bucket. Yeah. We're at school now. 
Oh, I don't like that. We, we've safely arrived at school, but it's so dark. I can't see anything. Hey, how about let's just go back home? Like this, I can't even see what's in front of my feet. Your loved ones can collect isekai insurance if you are suddenly killed and reincarnated into some isekai. <laughs> It'll be fine, since I have flashlights for the two of us. Huh? Flashlights? Thank God. This isn't pocket mirror. Thank God. Also, this music, it's like right in my ear. It's freaking me out. Okay, it seems like this will be enough for us to move forward, doesn't it? Uh, just, why are you so well prepared? I play horror games, Chitose. The, the sound of footsteps? Could it possibly be that someone other than us is here? It's probably the one girl that we've seen. To be at school at this kind of hour, what a bad kid, wouldn't you say? Thank God, spooky music. Um, I think that's why I stopped playing. I think I stopped playing at the school. Ooh. This is perfect, so let's go find that person and tell the teacher about this, perhaps. Hmm. The sound of footsteps came from the west. What if I don't want to go to the west? What if I want to go east? What if I want to go west? Quiet in here. It's not not a good thing. The dialogue is locked. This game's pretty good. After school, let's all go home quickly without stopping elsewhere along the way. According to my guide, in this part we must worship the cats. Ooh. Don't have to ask me to worship cats, I'll do it. Oh, okay, so this is blocked off. We have to go through this classroom. Or something. That music freaks me out. Yeah, I was too lazy to continue. That's a mood. That's me with most of the games that I'm playing on stream right now. I've played most of them before, like Pocket Mirror and Enroll. And then I just got too lazy to continue. There's a ton of cleaning equipment inside, but this is my first time playing Amayado. I think this is the big reason why I like streaming, because it forces me to finish games. <laughs> and not just be like, oh, I'm bored. Let me, let me play this one random game I found again. The faucet wasn't shut off very well, so there's water dripping from it. Huh? There's something falling inside. What is this? Yes, more heart fragments. How many we got? We got seven out of twelve. The faucet wasn't shut off very well. Oh god. I, I know what's gonna come here. Hold on. Hold on. Let me... Let me save. I know what's gonna happen. I know what's gonna happen. I play I play Japanese horror games. I know exactly what's gonna happen. I know exactly what's gonna happen in one of these. It's gonna be this one. Okay, maybe not. You have subverted my expectations, game. This is the boys' bathroom. Go in. No one's watching. Oh, I saw a fucking Kokeshi doll. Recently, it seems that a certain rumor has been spreading among the students. Don't you know what's gonna happen? <laughs> I'm gonna die. That's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna get dragged into the toilet by a hand. Or have a girl kill me. They say that when one goes to a certain bus stop, no longer in service, a bus that goes to the other world would come and take people along. There was also a similar rumor when I was a child. Even when times change, children don't. Why do you have a paper like this in your school? 
there's various documents stored away here. Oh, don't make me remember Corpse Party Mason with the bathroom. Huh. And the toilet monster will ask if you like red or blue paper. What was the thing that you're supposed to say to that? Like, is it yellow? Is yellow what you're supposed to ask for? There's various documents stored away here. Mixed in a bundle of accounting related documents is something that looks like a memo. 6891. I should probably write that down. Just a guess. Let me see. Made a note for my imaginary friend one, and then I'll make a note for Amayado. 6891. And then this one's for Amayado. There we go. Don't do that. I don't want to look at the Kokeshi doll. A doll? Why would this be here? They know exactly what they're fucking doing with that. Red cut up in, blue asphyxiation, other color, drugged to help, no paper, survive. Gotcha. Let's see, it's locked. Let me go up to four. This music is creepy. Notice from the school cleaner. Hiding and playing in the cleaning locker is dangerous, so please absolutely do not do it. You can enter the cleaning locker by facing it and pressing the decide button, so please absolutely do not do it. If you accidentally do enter it by mistake, please press the decide button again and go back outside immediately. Oh, that's confusing me. That just, that whole thing just uh, confused me. Quartz 42, electric boogaloo, when? Okay, give up wiping in order to survive. <laughs> when dead patient gets, get God, dead patient has just been in development hell. What happened? What happened? Hello? Oh, okay. The faucet won't shut off very well, so there's water dripping from it. I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm guessing I gotta go hide in there at some point, right? It's just my random guess, and then there's gonna be something in here, right? No? You can hide in a closet. You know what that means. Yeah! <sighs> this is the boys' bathroom. Go in it. <laughs> it's been a while since I've played a game like this where you gotta hide and run. Oh. Oh. I'm playing it alone this time. I'm not playing it with my friend that can take over for me when I get too freaked out. At least I have chat with me. <laughs> I don't have anything. There's nothing that way. Upstairs. Oh no, there's someone there. It's a bunch of people. A doll? Why would this be here? Hey, can you guys move out of the way? Okay, I guess not. Stairs looks like. 
Yes, Heidi Mechanics. No! I don't want to do this. What is with this? Like, what are those? Oh, are these like benches to sit on? I think that's what they're supposed to be. Nope, they aren't Mad Father dolls. No. Uh, a cat's voice? Maybe it lost its way into here. Okay, if it's for a cat, I'll be brave. Hello. <laughs> a cat! Cute! It's a Japanese school shoe racks. Gotcha. Oh, it isn't. Could you have lost your way into this school? Hey, don't act so friendly and just touch me like that, young girl. Eh, Kabato-chan, did you just talk? No, I didn't say anything. What are you playing dumb for? The one who talked to you just now was me. No way! The cat just talked? Is a cat talking, really? Something to be that surprised about now? Since that's that, what I'm here to tell you is that you can't overcome everything. What is this, Kobata-chan? Have cats started talking in recent days? I haven't heard of it. This cat is best cat. It is! I love this cat! Best character! Well, do your best not to die, young girl. Come back, let me pet you! Um, is this a dream? Ow, ow, ow! Kabata-chan, don't pinch my cheeks like that. This is reality. It seems so, doesn't it? Do a Lucifer impression for three minutes from Helltaker. Okay, what was even my voice for her? It was like something like, all right, let us go. It was something like this, like, right? It's the first one not to call her plane. All right, let's, I would like to recruit that cat. Alright, let us go. Oh, I see something on the ground here. Obtained a water bottle. I know certainly there are quite a few people on the internet that are a bit too thirsty. Alright, we've got the code to put in. 6891. It should be 6969. 6689. One. What? That's not the right one. I've been giving wrong information. What is it then? Imagine being thirsty. God. <laughs> you say that, Barn, but you're very thirsty. <laughs> I know you. I've seen the things that you have said concerning Miley and Claire. I'm always thirsty. <laughs> Sorry, Jinx Sprite. Oh no. Oh yes. That that's something Elia would say, but not something I would say. Oh no. Oh yes. All right. I need to find a key to get in there. Never. I've never said anything to suggest such heinous words. I believe that there is video evidence of that on the internet barn at this point. <laughs> Let me see. Okay. So one more minute. Let us see. What is in here? Okay, there's... there's Documents. Oh, why would they have this here anyway? Yes, you you did threaten to hold Okami's hand, Barn. And that is the highest lewd manner, as Modius would say. Hmm. Where do I go? Hand holding in my Christian Minecraft server? Well this is now a hellish Minecraft server. Alright, it's been three minutes. I I'm good with no longer talking like Lucifer. Alright. 
Well, I think I'm gonna actually end the stream there. I was gonna stream before I saw the Lucifer thing, but then I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll keep doing it as Lucifer. <laughs> All right. Uh, so that's gonna be it for Amayato bus stop for today. I bet you the next time I play this, I'm gonna get chased and I'm gonna have to hide inside of that thing. <sighs> anyway, thank you guys for coming for my stream. We still have art, however. So I'm gonna close out of Amayado and then share some art. I'm closing my eyes, holding hands, so lewd. <laughs> Man, all that Sarah emote <laughs> spam. Very good. All right, I'm gonna put on some music while I pull up the art. I just came back. Sorry about that, Roselette. You're still here for art though. Yep, there's Miley art. <laughs> Let me see. Let me pull up the Discord. So yes, if anyone is new to my streams, you can join my Discord if you put in exclamation point Discord. It should give you a link to my Discord. And if you do any fan art or art that you would like to share, I'll show them at the end of every stream if you post in the fan art or meme channels. Or alternatively, if you don't want to join Discord, you can at me on Twitter at StarryBunnyBoy. That's V-U-N-N-I-E. And you can send me your art on there. And I will also share from Twitter for that. But yes, with that out of the way, let me check to make sure I'm not missing any art real fast. Do 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 do. Alright, I have not missed any art that has been upload that has been uploaded while I stream, so that's good. Alright. So our first piece of art is by MC. Let me put this into Discord or not Discord. <laughs> so this is some designs for the Dungan Nompa uh, RP that we're doing with MC, and MC did some designs for some Monokumas. And let me... Don't not... Don't click that image. Click this image. Thank you. Thank you, OBS. I love you, OBS. No, stop clicking that. Okay, there we go. Let me make this smaller. Alright. And this is really cute. I love seeing them all colored up. I really, really like the bunny, like the Monami and Monokuma uh, combination looking one. As well as the bat. The bat looks really cute. <laughs> really good stuff, MC. I really like this. Thank you. I'm looking forward to all of the stuff that you're cooking up. And then we have some other art by MC, and this is of some more Monokumas. So we got the Nezumi. I remember MC was talking about the Nezumi. Nezumi or whatever it's called? I forget. But I remember I remember MC talking about the the mouse that scares the monokumas and stuff. And man, I really like I really like the one with like the yokai neck and all that. That is so cool. I love the little knife and everything. I love the colors of it. Like, it's really, really cool. Also, I noticed that the the Monokarasu, I think that's the name of the, the crow one. It has the words Mogu on it. Like, the, the word for munching. <laughs> this is very good. I really like the one in the middle. It's very good. And then, let me see. And then this is another art by NC, and it is of the man of the hour that has been mentioned in chat, Yogan Kuma. So this will be the Monokuma for when we get around to doing that Danganronpa IP. But yeah, so if you guys are interested in that, definitely wait warmly. Stuff is being made behind the scenes for it. I really like this. I love the colors. It's so good. I really like the, like, the right side with, like, the blood out of its eyes and stuff. It's so good. I love the mixture of colors. They all blend really well together. It's really cool. I really love Yogan Kuma's design a lot. 
Like, Yokan Kuma is my favorite of the designs, as well as the, uh, the one with the yokai neck. I forgot what his name was, but I really like him too. The mouse is based off Mar- Oh, I could definitely see that. The crow is based off of Chika from FNAF. Ooh, nice. Okay, that, that makes sense, because it says Mogu, which is like the eating sound effect. So like, let's eat, like with Chika. <laughs> Monofuriku. Oh, that's that's what its name was. Monofuriku. I really like Monofuriku and Yokan Kuma. I really like this art MC. I look forward to seeing more of it. Thank you. And then we have an art by Goldie. And let me read their comment that they said in the Discord real fast. Let me find that. Uh, let's see. What did they say? Let me find it. Uh, just a little drawing I did for stress relief. There's no sketch, I just winged it. So the character isn't that the best, but as I said, it was done just to relax. I think this is really good. Like, considering that you, like, did this all at once, like, that's really impressive. I really like the colors of this character as well. I really like brown and green. Like, characters with a brown and green character, like, uh character design, I always really like them. There's something really gentle about that combination of colors. I really like the way that you did their hair in this. It's really, really good. This is really nice for like a quick sketch. Like, man, Goldie, your skills, so good. It's a very simple but notable character design. Yes, definitely. I really like this. So thank you for sharing that with us, Goldie. And then, See our next piece of art. Let me let me look and find it. Okay. All right. So our next piece of art is by Rosalette. Let me drag that in here. So this is. Let me lower their the size of it so everyone can see it. It's really good. I've already seen this before, and it's really, really good, and it really fits what you were wanting to do it for. Let me... Man, this is really good. This is really good stuff right here, Rosette. Like, man, the colors. So yes, this is a uh, Monster Prom uh, 2 character to, that they made up, and it looks really, really good. Like, like, like I said, this looks exactly like it is just like a canon character in Monster Prom. The coloring, the drawing, like it just fits so well with the Monster Prom aesthetic and the way that you drew it is just excellent. And I believe he's was saying, uh, it's not made up, is oh, it's Milo from Monster Prom 2. Okay, I haven't seen anything about Monster Prom 2 lately. It's really cool, I really like this. It's very cool. I think you were saying that you were thinking of making it into a sticker. I would love to have a sticker of this because it looks really cool. It definitely fits in as a sticker, like definitely. Really cool stuff, Roslette. So thank you for that. And then, let me see what our next art is. And some more art from Roslette. So let me put that one in here. Let me see, let me see, there we go. This is of Yuki from A3. So, mm -hmm. Let us go down a bit. Man, this is so good, Roslette. Oh my god. Your art is just so good. I love the colors of this. And the facial expression you gave on Yuki just looks so gentle. I love him. Sunset look nice, Yuki. The sunset does look nice. I like the way that you drew the sunset. It's really nice and warm. Just this entire drawing just radiates warmth. I really like the way that you did Yuki's hair as well. But his face expression is just really gentle. Also, I love the clothes. I remember you were saying that the clothes really fit Yuki and they definitely do. I really love this. This is really good art of Yuki, Roslette. I really like it. You captured, you captured the entire mood of like a sunset. Yeah, it's definitely got that warm feeling of it. 
Thank you for sharing that with me, Roselette. I really wanted to give him warmth because he's an angry bean. <laughs> well, you succeeded in that. He looks very warm in that. And then we have some art by Hagareko. They did, they were trying out a new art style for this with this kana. And I really like this art style. It is so good. And I really like their usage of like textures and stuff. I always love how they draw kana because I really like the, the floofiness of Kana's hair. Like, this is adorable. I love this art style. They've been doing a lot more of it, which I will be showing in a moment. But yeah, I really like this a lot, Hagu. Yeah, this art style is so cute. Love it. Also, I wish Kana would feel better. Baby, don't cry. And then we got some more art by Hagu. So this is of Noelle. They were asking for like a what character to draw next in the style and I thought Noelle would fit in really well with the style and I was proven right by Hagu because this is really good. I like all of the star textures that Hagu used for it too. Like this is really good. I really like all of the textures. He looks so cute too. He's so gentle. This is really, really cute. Like. I would want this as like a like a bookmark or something. Like this looks really cute. I would definitely put this as like a little bookmark, like maybe while I'm reading like a fairy tale story about a prince. Because he's a prince, you know? Very cute. Very cute. And then we've got an art of now in this art style by Hagu. Once again, very good. God, I love the facial expression of her and the colors, definitely. I like the usage of colors. It really shows that Nao is like, you know, a painter. So she would definitely have a very colorful background. And man, baby girl, baby girl, don't cry. I love you, baby girl. You're so cute. Like God, I love the way Hagu does their little chibi faces, like the, the little eyelashes and stuff. It's so cute. And I really like this. Story. It's really hard to make like, at least for me, at least for me, it's hard to make good art styles with like black coloring. Like you're so used to using black to like draw it, but like using white for like the details, it's, uh, it's always hard to really process in my head. So it's really cool, this art style that Hagu has for me. Like, I really like this. Thank you. And then our last piece of art is also by Hagu. And it is of our boy. Our boy So, I love him, he's so good. Also today should be the third anniversary of your turn to die. So I'm excited to see if anything gets revealed tonight. But yes, I really like this. I really like his like little like sparkly, like freckle looking stuff on his face and all of the colors. Like man, how do you do this? How do you do this, Hagu? How do you make all those cool looking like textures they all like really flow together really well and have like this really unique air of mystery kind of like a dream kind of i really like it i love his eyes that over the shoulder look though yeah he given you bedroom eyes god this is so good Hagu. i really like it and let me just check to make sure i'm not missing anything yeah i think i think i got everything so that is it for the art for today. Thank you everyone that came in to join me for the stream today. It was really, really fun. I had a lot of fun with imaginary friends as well as Amayato bus stop, even though Amayato bus stop was terrifying me near the end. <laughs> I can see these art pieces in a visual novel. Oh yes, yes, definitely. I like to see Hagu make a visual novel. I think Hagu was talking about making a game or a comic and God, if they do, I would be so excited. Like, man, Hagu's art is so good. That's like, like with MC, I think MC would be a really good character designer too. Like MC's character designs are really, really good. Yeah, let me look at the schedule real fast. Okay, so tomorrow will be another imaginary friend stream as well as Pocket Mirror. So that will be at 4 p.m. PST. So I will see you guys tomorrow at 4. See you guys then. Bye-bye. Have a good day, you guys. Good night. An awesome stream. Thank you. Good night, guys. Hope you have a good night. <laughs>